Coming back on this Monday night, the Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation is asking for public input on proposed rule changes for sport fishing. News 12's Kayla Holt explains and has reaction from a local angler. The Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation is proposing a 10 fish bag limit per person per day for native non-game fish. It's a proposal bone fisherman Stephen Bonazak is calling extreme. This proposal would make native non-game fish three times more regulated than game fish um, due to the number of species that this incorporates. Senior fisheries biologist for the Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation, Jason Schooley, says these non-game species don't reproduce every year and have been underappreciated for their conservation value. So being that they do not have any harvest limits, um, we needed to sort of start that conservation process and demonstrate that they have value by placing a limit on them. But Bonazak says bow fishermen care about these fish as well and doesn't agree with the proposed bag limit. We educate the public about these fish that historically have always been ignored. We love these fish and if we were going out and seeing that there was a shortage of them, we would be the first in line to try to save them. Schooley argues that while there isn't any data supporting any of the species going extinct, the possibility is there. Some of them are already imperiled. However, we have not been studying these species long enough to have a long-term perspective on them. But those against the proposal say they want to see the data that's been collected. You cannot set a precedent forward to pass these regulations and limits without there being any data that shows it's necessary. There's a lot of upset people. We, we often take a step back and say, okay, is this the right thing to do at the right time? The Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation will be taking public comments into consideration now until December 8th. Reporting Kayla Holt, News 12.